This video is sponsored by Professional Photographers of America. What's up guys, I got a brand new video for you today. Here with Kira. We got the A7 IV, but we're just gonna go super gothic and dark with it, because this location is sick. Yeah, there's like the old projector place. This camera's got nutty autofocus. Go for it. Stop right there. Look down towards me. around this way a bit. Get a little bit more light on your face. Yeah, I love when you look down that direction. Look down at the gun now. The lighting's so good. It's like super diffused and like... Ooh, spooky. Danger zone. It looks like it was a movie set designed to be like in like a Twister episode or something. Yeah, totally. Cause yeah, the sun is out. It might hit some clouds eventually. On a scale of one to dead, how dead are you? Like five? Five. Five alive. Five alive. <laughs> it's like so bright. It's okay, when I, when I edit these shots, they're not gonna look as bright. I might even make a lot of these black and white too. Yeah, you can move around in there if you want, just like walk back and forth. Oh, of course it gets dark. I don't know how, but it's locked onto your eye and your face in there. Yeah, I like the veil up. I'm gonna switch to my 85. Oh, this lens is creamy. Look towards the sun this direction. You can keep your eyes closed. Kinda like that when you're holding up the dress. What if we do it in the gravel though so we can see the boots? Tilt your head off to your left shoulder. Close your, like tilt it into your left shoulder and then close your eyes. That's sick. <laughs> this camera's crazy. And even when it fills up, it still lets you shoot like five more frames every couple seconds. Before we switch out to the second outfit, I want to talk about today's sponsor, Professional Photographers of America. I'm a member and here's why I think you might want to join as well. Having your camera gear insured is important and I've advocated this before if you've owned your own photography business. With PPA, you get a lot of benefits and one of those benefits is $15,000 worth of equipment insurance and that's included in your membership. And what's great is that it's full replacement coverage with a flat $350 deductible or if you want to repair your own equipment, it's a flat $50 deductible. So that's pretty incredible and I'd say that's pretty unbeatable. You also get data loss recovery services, which is a great peace of mind. You'll get access to customizable contracts, cancellation letters, model release forms, copyright transfers, and so much more. There's also a nice education platform to help you grow your photography business and you'll learn from the best educators. Honestly, all of these things would cost way more on their own, but it's all included in your membership for just a small monthly fee. And if you sign up today using my link in the description, you'll get $25 off your PPA membership. Thanks Professional Photographers of America for sponsoring today's video. So it is Halloween and spooky season, so we're trying to do kind of like a spooky dead themed shoot. And uh, Kira's just changing into the next outfit right now, but the shots are looking amazing. I don't know if I'm gonna get this out in time for Halloween, only because I wanna be able to look at the raw files, and so maybe I only put this out once I can see the raw files. My thrifting skills are coming into play here. Is it the same color, or is it a little bit off? <laughs> it's a little bit off. It's a little bit off, but it's not that bad. It doesn't look as like gothic as we were going for before. Kind of kind of think that a sawed off shotgun would complete this outfit. So let's do one where your foot's just up just a little bit. It almost looks like you're stepping on a, something that doesn't exist. All right, here we go, three, two, one. Yeah, hold that. I found the perfect spot for uh, the light to come through and, and make your face like have a silhouette through the light.
I think if we walk like side, like almost parallel with this edge, the light's gonna come through at a few spots and look really cool. Go for it. Tracking spot, small. This is my new favorite way to shoot. Because if it misses your eye, it just sticks right onto your face still. Oh, I'll have a seat. Tip the hat up just a bit. You almost have to come out a little further, I guess. I just want to be able to see up. Yeah, there's actually some really nice texture. Look down towards me and tilt your head off to your left. Hold that with your eyes closed. Oh, let's try that again. Like you're almost peering out over the edge. But looking straight on with the camera still. Look off out that direction. Can you look out more? Look down at the camera. Bring your other hand up too, so they're both up. Yeah. Okay, straight on. Oh yeah, keep the one hand down, that was cool. Looking straight into the camera now. Dope. I think we're done. All right, thanks for watching this video, you guys. Thanks, Akira. No problem. Always crushing it. We got the shoot done really fast. That was the A7 IV. Oh yeah, my, my Iron Man chest. I'll put a link in the description of this bad boy too, but yeah, thanks for watching this video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. If you dislike this video, give it a thumbs down twice. Don't forget to hit that notification bell. See you guys in the next one. Bye. Once again, thanks to Professional Photographers of America for sponsoring this video. You look so dead. Look at these glasses. German. <laughs> double belts across my waist. Look at those double belts. Well, I just dropped that into the stones. <laughs>